Amongst all sectors, the mobility sector is the only one with rising emissions. At present, internal combustion engine vehicles make up 96% of all vehicles in the European Union. Making this entire fleet zero emission is one of the greatest challenges of the 21st century. Isn't it striking that we're only discussing whether to use fuel cell electric vehicles or battery electric vehicles to replace our existing ones? It's a fact that producing 300 million vehicles entirely new results in tremendous emissions and use of resources. The traffic turnaround, as it is discussed right now, does not comply with the United Nations Sustainable Development Goal, Responsible Consumption and Production. So why don't we use our existing vehicles and only replace the polluting parts? The concept of converting vehicles to electric has three key benefits. First of all, because you don't have to produce the vehicles entirely new, you save up to 50% of the emissions and use of resources in production. Second, for the same reason, it also gets more affordable for the people. Finally, a solution that is affordable to everyone. Last but not least, it means people can keep their old beloved vehicles. Especially here in Germany, vehicles mean a lot more to people than just a form of transportation. Also nach meiner Meinung ist es besonders an dem Projekt, dass es wirklich nachhaltig ist. Also dass zum Beispiel hier nicht ein komplettes Motorrad ausgetauscht wird. Und deswegen sind der Karl und ich da zusammengekommen und ich habe gesagt, ich werde das unterstützen. One and a half years ago, I founded Secondhand Mobility, a student-led project at Technische Universität Berlin. I wanted to investigate the feasibility of converting vehicles to electric at high scale. Each semester, 15 students from different disciplines work autodidactically and practically on the project. We needed to prove that the conversion of vehicles to electric does not need to be costly, time-consuming or be reserved to experts. Over the past three semesters, we developed a conversion kit for Simson motorcycles that enables anyone to convert such motorcycles to electric in just one afternoon. We are definitely not the first having the idea of converting vehicles to electric. But we might have solved one of the biggest issues that held it back of being a viable option for future mobility. Simpson motorbikes are the most produced scooters in Germany of all time. Our modular conversion kit solution allows us to scale production with little effort, creating a quick, easy and affordable conversion option. When we first started this project, we never would have thought that it would be that easy to convert vehicles in just half an hour. But here we are. All you have to do is unscrew the old engine, Mount our drive unit with two screws, replace the seat with three screws and replace the throttle. You can even do it on the street without any special tools, skills or knowledge. These scooters have an outstanding retro design and a part of East German history in them. That's what makes them so extraordinary and iconic. It has a huge fan base who someday won't be able to drive them anymore because of combustion engine bans. But aren't they worth preserving and bringing them back to life and back to the future? If we can prove that our conversion option would be really a way for clean mobility to be more affordable while even cutting emissions in half, this could really kick off a revolutionary disruptive change in the mobility sector. Join us on our mission of making future mobility truly sustainable.